here's a short tutorial on how to perform the dodge stomp boost trick to get super launched into the air in Sonic Frontiers. This is by no means a definitive tutorial, but hopefully it will help having most of the information in a short, concise package. Check the progress bar for timestamps and the description for any relevant links. The trick involves dodging, the stomp combo attack, and air boosting, and it was initially found and shared by Dark Spine Sonic, hence the name Dark Spine Shuffle, or DSS. Vorken the Beta found that this technique could be used to get into the Kronos Island Titan boss arena early, and there's even a spot in that boss arena to trigger the fight. Since it involves launching Sonic very high into the air, they called this use of the technique the Hedgehog Space Program, or HSP. The only requirements for doing this trick is having an enemy that you can lock onto and combo attack, and having the stomp ability unlocked, which can be done fairly early. It currently works on all platforms of the game at both 30 and 60 FPS, and what you're seeing was done on the PC version at 60 FPS. As for executing it, the inputs on an Xbox controller would be as follows. Lock onto an enemy which is a press of the right analog stick. Perform a dodge by pressing right or left bumper while holding the appropriate direction on the analog stick so Sonic actually dodges rather than standing still. A B press to initiate the stomp, and then right trigger to boost just after Sonic starts to move up. If Sonic gets above the enemy as part of the stomp animation, you are too late or just didn't boost. Dodging to the side can cancel the stomp, which can be helpful if you want to repeatedly try against the same enemy without killing it. If you do get launched up, but at more of an angle with a noticeable forward momentum, you were slightly too late. With the most optimal timing, you go almost directly straight up, though you do still have that momentum. It's just not very clear with how fast you're going upwards. While in the air, going up or coming down, pressing the dodge buttons will move you the appropriate direction, but it does cancel your upwards momentum as well as moving you down two or three Sonic's height with every dodge. That said, it can be useful, just use it after you are clearly starting to fall back down. As for performing the HSP and getting into Giganto's arena early, these enemies not far from the waterfall do work, though I am uncertain if they are optimal. If you are too low, you might hit the game's exploration barrier that has dialogue telling you to turn back. Assuming you are above that and get past it, you might hit the side of or land atop some invisible walls that I believe circle the arena. Just running along these towards the center should get you down there. From there, just run to the spot which is where the trigger to spawn Giganto and initiate the fight can be found. All that said, that's it for this brief tutorial, hopefully that can help. Shoutouts again to Darkspine Sonic for discovering this technique, Vorg in the beta for sequence break potential, and Sonic for being the color blue. Goodbye.